Anytime my heart turns from darkness to light Anytime temptation comes and someone stands to fight Anytime somebody lives to serve and not be served I know, I know, I know, I know God is on the I'm Mary Ann, I was in crew number two, and I was a devotion leader. I'm Kelly, I was in crew eight, and I was a work director. I'm Aubrey, I was in crew eight also, and I was the progress reporter. I'm Clayton, I was in group five, and I was the break maker. I'm Jaden, and I was in crew one, and I was the devotion leader. I'm Travis, I was in crew number four, and I was the party for me. My name is Savannah Webker and I was on crew eight. Uh, my personal job was carrying around the map to get to place place and the first aid to every crew site we went to. It was fun working in the kitchen, preparing meals, and it was also very fun playing nine square with the kids from different groups and getting to know them that way. Anytime the gospel stirs a searching soul, and someone says, send me, here I go. I know, I know, I know, I know. God is on the move, on the move, hallelujah. God is on the move in many mighty ways. God is on the move, on the move, hallelujah. God is on the move, on the move. based on Luke 24, um, the story about the walk to Emmaus. Hey, uh, Kelly, Tuesday was free time. What did we do? Um, well, after we got done working at our sites and showering, we went to the Garfield Community Home, which is run by my cousin. And then after that, we went to the Mall of America, and we ate and then shopped. At the mall, what did the girls do and what did the guys do? Do you remember? The girls went mostly clothing shopping and the guys did more like technology stuff and they played games and all of that. Did you have fun? Yeah, it was a blast. Well, Nine Square is kind of like a bigger version of Four Square. It's where there's different people you have to go around in the circle, you have to try to get in the middle. And if someone hits the ball and it lands in your square and you don't hit it out, you have you have to go out and go back to the end of the line. So I didn't really win now and I think I only got to the middle like two times. Give me your heart for the ones forgotten Give me your eyes so I can see Yeah 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 Step out on a busy street See a girl in our eyes meet Does her best to smile at me To hide what's underneath There's a man just to right Black suit and a bright red tie Too ashamed to tell his wife he's out of work He's buying time He had to go for meal preparation You'd get up uh, earlier than the others and then you'd go and you'd prepare the breakfast for every other group in the whole mission trip So then we'd get it ready like start cooking it and get the yogurt in the morning and uh, set out the salad bar. And then for housekeeping, after we have dinner, we have to sweep up the gym 
for after we eat, because that's where we eat and play nice wear. And then we, uh, yeah, we just like sweep up and around the area. Orange had to lead the devotions with the groups that we were with at our locations. Were you nervous at first on that first day? Yeah. But did it get better? Yeah. Give me your eyes for just one second. Give me your eyes so I can see everything that I keep missing. Give me your love for humanity. Give me your arms for the broken hearted, the ones that are far beyond my reach. Give me your heart for the ones forgotten. Give me your eyes so I can see. Give me your eyes for just one second. Lord, give me your eyes so I can see everything that I keep missing. Center and the Boys and Girls Club and at the Friends Center we did activities and played games with the older people and at the Boys and Girls Club we pretty much played with the kids and that was lots of fun and my job was the progress reporter so when we went back to the church every day I would tell the leaders um, how our day went. Come set your rule and reign in our hearts again. Increase in us, we pray. Unveil why we're made. Come set our hearts ablaze with hope, like wildfire in our very souls. Holy Spirit, come invade us now. We worked at the Friendship Center and the Boys and Girls Club. Our job at our mission trip was to go to elderly people's houses and do yard work. And our crew also went to the Boys and Girls Club for one day. Okay, so we worked with at old people's houses, cleaning windows and uh, picking weeds up and stuff like that. And then we spent one day playing with the kids at the Boys and Girls Club. Our cruise project for the week was the first two days we went to the Boys and Girls Club, and then the next two we went to the food group. Our crew worked at the Boys and Girls Club two days, and at the food shelter for two days. 